Next tonight, the tragic fire that claimed the life of a Buffalo matriarch. 24 hours after her Buffalo home went up in flames, family and friends are remembering the mother of 10 and what she meant to her whole community. A grieving sister tells 7 Eyewitness News reporter Nikki Dementri, this was God's plan. 96 years old. She would have been 97 October 1st this year. And for Mary Parks, many of those years were spent right here at 10 Harlow Place on Buffalo's east side. Now, just a memory. You don't pick and choose the way we leave here. A fire? No, I wouldn't have never dreamt that my mother would have passed away in a fire. Parks was a mother of 10 and a mother figure to many more. Her daughter, also named Mary Parks, lives right across the street. Her sister lives two doors down. I'm on Purdy. She's on Harlow, a little one-way street. My house faces hers. Just the fact of knowing that my mother's house existed right there, that's a hard thing, because I've been coming out of this house for 30 some years and the first place my eyes go is over there. But today, she didn't want to go outside as a bulldozer went through what's left of her childhood home. When they think of Harlow Place and think of Mrs. Parks, she's the matriarch of that street. Park's late husband, Joseph, was a bricklayer. He built the home where the family lived for decades. This is my mom and my dad. I will always keep this picture and them close to my heart. Parks worked at the Ford stamping plant until her early 70s. And even in her retirement years, she kept busy as a welcoming face in her community and at Calvary Baptist Church nearby. God has taken my mother to a better place. I love my mother. She was a strong woman, too. And tonight, investigators say the fire was accidental. Now the family is still working out funeral arrangements this evening. Live in the studio tonight, Nikki Dementri, 7 Eyewitness News.